Elder Lorenzo Snow said 46 years had passed away since the organization of the church, and it had withstood all the storms that had been brought to bear against it. A man by the name of Joseph Smith started out with a declaration that God had spoken to him, committed to him certain principles and authority, which he was commanded to make known to the people, with a promise that whoever would receive his testimony and be obedient to the heavenly message should receive the Holy Ghost. That would reveal to its recipients a knowledge of the truth of that testimony. Many thousands who were assembled here today, gathered from the various nations of the earth, had received that spirit that was given to them by the laying on of hands which the servants of God had promised them. The greatest gift that God could possibly give to the sons of men was the gift of salvation, and after we had embarked in the great work, there was no sacrifice too great for us to make, so that we might secure the blessings of eternal life. The ordinances and gifts of the gospel we appreciated so highly that no earthly consideration would deter us from cleaving to the pearl of great price. If we would only keep the commandments of God, our whole body should be full of light, and we would be able to comprehend all things. He exhorted the saints to become more and more allied to the Spirit of the Lord, and improve day by day in their life and conduct, to be governed not by their own will, but by the counsel of those whom God has placed over us. Let us discharge all our obligations in the fear of God that we might finally be saved in the kingdom of God.